Them. What are you doing down here? My grandfather and those men in suits locked me down in this cell. Please, miss. You have to help me get out of here. Of course I'll help. Stay calm, okay? Everything will be alright. I promise. Okay, miss. Where are your parents? My father is on a business trip. He should be back in a couple of days. And my mother was also captured by those men. I'm so sorry. I'll get you out of here. First, we need to find a way to open the door. What do you plan to do, miss? Those men in suits took the key with them. And I don't think it's a good idea that you get close to them. I'm sure there's a way to get the lock off without using the key. Please hurry. There isn't much time. We need to save Mother. We'll get you out. Just wait a little longer. Have you found a way to open up the cell door? I'm working on it. Don't be afraid. We'll get you out of there. Please, miss. You are my only hope. Have you... I'm... Please... done to the lock, miss? I poured some acid on it. The metal will eventually dissolve, but it will take some time. I only hope that the acid works fast. There's almost no candle left. You have to be patient, little one. Sooner or later, the lock will fall apart. For now, the best we can do is wait. Thank you, miss. What is your name, little one? I'm Anna. Anna Wildberger. I live here in the hospital with my parents and my sister. Have we met before? Your face seems familiar, but I'm sure we've never seen each other before. Do you work in the hospital? No, but I have this photograph. Are you one of these girls? What? Why do you have this photograph? I don't know, but I'm trying to figure it out. It was mailed to me a few weeks ago. A few weeks ago? My father took that photo yesterday morning, just before he left for his trip. Why are you lying to me? I swear I'm not lying. I'm telling the truth. What do you want from me? I just want to help you get out of here. I'm not talking to you anymore. That acid was probably another lie to fool me. You never wanted to help me get out. Anna, you have to listen to me. I need you to trust me. I am your friend. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Anna, listen to me.
I don't want to talk to you anymore.
Father, what happened to you? You're in shock. We need to take care of your injury before you bleed out. He's lost an arm. I must find a way to help him. He's lost a...
Father, are you okay? Carolyn, my child. That thing has stolen my Bible. Stay there, Father. Right now, it's vital that you keep calm. Yes, you're right. I don't know how I'll be able to thank you for taking care of my arm, my child. What are you talking about, Father? It wasn't me. But I saw you. Oh, uh, you are right. I'm getting confused. Now that I think about it, it was Dr. William who treated my arm. Dr. William, the Wildberger twin's father. Is he in the mansion? I had no idea Dr. William had daughters. Where can I find him? He's usually in his office. You'll probably find him there. I'll go find him. He might be able to give me some answers. Thank you, Father. I'm sure this will be of help. God be with you, child.
Something tore off one of the priest's arms. Thankfully, the doctor, William, surgically replaced it with a new one. I didn't even realize a procedure like that was possible. I also discovered that William is the father of the twins in the photo. I should go to his office to see if he can give me some useful information.